using number 10-12 by one inch type A pancake head fasteners, install eave trim or gutter with flange. Fasteners should be set five feet apart on center. Apply three 32nd inch by one inch roll tape sealant continuously along length of eave. Only install as much tape as can be covered during that day's installation and only remove the protective paper from what is about to be covered. Using number 14-10 by one and one half inch HHA fasteners, install aluminum vented eave strip on top of gutter flange with tape seal. Fasteners should be set one foot apart on center. Install Python Vent. After shingle ridge cap removal, install U-panel at ridge using floor number 9-15 by 1 inch HWH type A fasteners per panel. Notch and hem panel before installation. For slopes of 3 to 12 or less, panels must be bread panned at the ridge. Install panels by hooking hemmed end of panel onto aluminum vented eave strip. Using number 14-10 by 1 and 1 half inch HHA fasteners, install 138T shingle recover clip on side of panel. Holes and clips should align with end of shingle tabs. Drive fasteners through end of shingles into deck below. Starting at ridge, hand seam down 18 inches. Hand seam periodically at the clip locations to hold everything in place. Starting at eave end of panel, hand seam up 12 inches. Install 3 16 inch by 7 8 inch double bead sealant, tape to bottom flange of Z closure. Using one 1 quarter 14 by 7 8 inch Laptec Zack fastener per rib, install Z closure on top of 138T panel. Apply urethane sealant up the vertical legs of the Z closures. Apply 3 32nd inch by 1 inch roll tape sealant on top of closure, 
between closure and vintage trim. Using 1 quarter 14 by 7 8 inch LapTech fasteners, install aluminum vented eaves strip on top of Z closure. Fasteners should be set 6 inches apart on center. Install Python vent. Install ridge cap. Once trim is on, run the seamer.